Hello guys, what is up? My name is Dan the Delight and today I'm bringing you a Dodo Road to the Knockouts player review. This is the 84 rated right back, uh, 5 foot 5, high medium on the work rates, 3 star skill moves, 3 star weak foot, right footed, mostly explosive, born a day after me, so I'm hoping that he is a good player. Um, right back or right wing back, no other positional changes, I tend to play right backs over right wing backs. 90 pace, really really solid of course, don't need me to tell you that. Only 71 shooting, he's got weirdly 94 attack positioning, I have no idea idea why uh, when everything else is quite low in terms of like finishing shot power etc 82 passing really solid it's only the free kick accuracy just really bringing that down 58 everything else is nice on the card there 85 dribbling uh, the agility and balance really really high ball controls decent dribbling is decent only 77 defending seems to be a, a, a theme with right backs and left backs nowadays the defending is one of the lower stats um, but 80 standing tackles nice 79 defen defensive awareness it's just the head and accuracy at 60 just really bringing the card down um, and then 78 physical, nice again, 73 strength could be increased, put a chemistry style on there and job is a good and really nice stamina which is important for a right back and 81 jumping, 79 aggression. So uh, let's get into some gameplay with him. All right, unfortunately, as you can see, I am 3-0 down. There's been lagging issues, but here is Bruno, and he managed to get a goal. That's a good shot there on the outside of his foot, um, and he, he gets his goal with his 89 shooting. His finishing is a little low, but the rest of the stats there are very good. So very, very nice there for Bruno, uh, managing to get a goal to at least make it 3-0. Um, unfortunately, Dodo um, has been pretty bad this game. He's been um, just run ragged by Sancho. You saw it there as well. I don't know what's going on with him. Uh, and, you know, this is going to go into the second half this game anyway. Um, I'm not just sort of showing the first uh, two minutes or in-game two minutes of the game and then leaving it there. So it does, does go into the second half. But yeah, Dodo's just not been good. Fernandez with a decent pass there. And there's Machado finally getting onto the ball as well. It makes a decent enough ball into the middle, but it was just so crowded. This game, for some reason, it, the middle just seems so crowded to me. I don't know why. Um, but there's Machado trying to get there. And again, as I said, we're going into the second half half here so that was the first half done I got pretty much dominated not gonna lie he's Gabriel Jesus I don't know what was going on but he absolutely just tore me a new one um, and unfortunately we do go into it 3-1 down hopefully that won't be the case um, in the second half as long as Dodo uh, Machado and obviously Bruno have a good game then that's the main thing there is Dodo on the ball making decent enough pass to Kovacic um, and again, just not good enough there. The passing just seems sloppy from um, from Dodo for sure. Um, and, Mache and his strength as well. I think, is it here? He gets absolutely just done by Sancho. Okay, no, maybe not there. There's a, there's a moment coming up where he just... Sancho's not the strongest of players and he absolutely obliterates Dodo off the ball and um, that one should probably have ended up in the back of the net not gonna lie um, and again I don't want to be too harsh on Dodo but it was probably his fault to begin with here is Machado though terrible terrible pass I don't know what is going on with these players um, to be honest unfortunately they're just not clicking for me um, here is Bruno though on the ball so I want to I want to test that his dribbling I didn't really get a chance to because it's so congested in the middle um, unfortunately his dribbling has seemed pretty good but for me that is like his standout stat um, alongside obviously his passing and his passing has been very very solid uh, which you'll see for the remainder of this game but yeah Dodo again they're just being caught out here I think this may, might be it yeah He's just, I don't know what's going on with this guy. <laughs> there we go. He just can't get the ball. Uh, for a defender not to be able to get the ball, a bit worrying. Um, seeing as that is exactly what his whole job really is. Um, but yeah, we need to get Bruno into the match a little bit more than what we are. He's, I don't know, there's a great interception, interception from Machado. Good turn, good pass from Bruno, and he's making a nice little run through the middle. Again, the middle is just so congested, though. I don't know what formation this guy's rocking, but it's just completely overcrowding me in the middle uh, here's Bruno in a good position outstrength though by a Chalaba uh, which is a massive shame I would have liked to have been able to turn and got a shot away there um, again Dodo ready for this just getting left it for dust by Sancho um, so not a good inning for Dodo to be honest unfortunately he is the lowest rated um, road to the knockouts um, card so I'm not too surprised but you know you're playing a bit more for him. I would have expected him to be decent. Nice little ball from Bruno. Setting up the play. Um, pretty much setting up this whole attack, to be honest. Um, but 
for some reason we couldn't do anything with it again no. just the middle as soon as we get it into the middle we lose the ball um, which is just seems to be the theme of this game unfortunately see what Machado can do here against da Diani who is just an absolutely insane card so he had his work cut out a little bit more than what Dodo did over there on Sancho um, but again Machado didn't really do a good job here either um, unfortunately um, but yeah, I don't know. There's Bruno. Great pass again. I mean, Bruno's been the standout. He hasn't been fantastic, fantastic. But to be honest, I think given a few more games, he would be fantastic. Like, his passing, I can definitely see, is very good. Um, his dribbling seems pretty nice. He scored the goal with the outside of his boot. Um, he's, he's quick. He's, he's sort of probably the best player on the pitch at this point in time. Probably not saying too much. Here is Machado. What a touch that is. <laughs> and uh, yeah sums him up I suppose not oh we win the foul fair enough uh, but yeah not been the most uh, sort of useful um, fullback I'm not too over or oh, not not really going to get anything there I'm not too like over keen on either of Dodo or Machado in this game um, if I'm going to be honest um, I would have been expecting a little bit more from a, a promo card um, especially you know against J Jaden Sancho whose card is not really uh, that good do you, do you get, Diani is a tough um, opponent, and to be fair, Machado did really, really well there to get the foot in. Again, it all goes through Bruno, though. As soon as we get to that middle, he is able to just pick out a pass very quickly and then start any attack that we do have, which, uh, you know, we haven't had many, <laughs> I'm not going to lie, um, but any that we have had, it does come through Bruno, so that's a very good sign. I think that he is a great card. Um, but he's going to be going for a lot of coins, especially if Man U can somehow get out of their group, which will be a struggle. They have got the group of death and um, they lost their first game. But you, you never know. Champions League's a funny old thing. Some teams do end up getting like second place or something and he would get some upgrades. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Not uh, not looking good for the <laughs> for the left back or the right back, though. Really not a good showing for Dodo or Machado. So uh, yeah, let's get back into the Alright, so you can probably tell where I'm going with this review, to be honest. Um, 90 pace, maybe, uh, and pr probably decreased that a little bit um, to like 87, 88. To be honest, the pace wasn't really the issue that I had with him. It was mainly the strength um, and defending side of things. Shooting, I'm not going to touch because he is a right back. He didn't have any shots with him. 82 passing, felt... Mm. Probably about 82. 82 is not a very high stat. He, I didn't really notice that he didn't do anything too bad, but he didn't really do anything good either. Um, 85 dribbling, could probably leave. Is He didn't feel sluggish or anything like that, so his agility and balance did feel quite high. But here's the problem. 77 defending, he did not feel like he could defend it against a bronze to be honest so I'm going to bring his defending down to a 73 really bad defending I, I don't know it just didn't feel good for me at all he was getting beat by Sancho he's not a good card and in the physical as well his strength is not 73 his strength can only be described as around like a, a 60 something it was terrible um, he felt like a flick could knock him down Sancho is not a strong player and he was just out muscling Dodo in every single um, every single duel so bring that physical down to a 70 overall so you can tell where I'm going with this. Even with upgrades, I do not think that this card is usable. <laughs> so hopefully you did like the video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more videos like this. There will be a link in the description down below full of EAFC 24 player reviews. As always, guys, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.